Good morning. I'm Roger Duffy with Marine Max Sail and Ski. Join me for a tour of this beautiful 2021 Sea Ray SLX 400. This one has the R package, which is a special package with special interior colors, special exterior colors, and several fun features that we'll see along the way. The first thing you'll notice about this boat is the massive cockpit seating. There's probably room for 15 people seated comfortably in a U-shape pattern here in this boat. And you've got a double-sized table that's there when you need it or half-size when people are trying to move around. It's a really great feature. And then this seat will move to where it's forward facing for these two people when you're underway. I'll show you how that works. Nice and easy to have it forward facing. This boat has been nicknamed the Entertainer and I think the seating shows you why, but consistent with that theme would be the need for two built-in grills on this boat and two refrigerators here. Check out how these slide out so they're easy to load and easy to get to. And then you've even got two trash cans here because you know you're gonna have a lot of empties when you're entertaining this many people. Come check out the helm. You'll see the dual 12 inch Simrad screens. Sea Ray has fully eliminated the need for gauges here. You've got your radar, your chart plotter, depth, and all the engine gauges are completely uh, displayed on these two units for you. This boat also is equipped with the Mercruiser Axius joystick steering which means that you can dock this boat using just this joystick right here. It's so easy your 10 year old could do it. One of the other features that I really love about the Axios system is the skyhook button. You can press that button and it'll hold this boat still within a 10 foot circle. So if you're waiting for the gas dock or just you know hanging out waiting for a parking place, you don't have to keep moving the boat. The boat does it itself. Let's check out the hard top before we go and look at the rest of the boat. This has got an opening port here that simply slides back. So if you want a lot of sun, you can open up the hard top. And if you want shade, you can close it. Check out the blacked out radar dome and the blacked out TV antenna. It just adds to the cool graphic of this boat closing that up because I love the shade. That closes and you can see we've got a bit of a sunroof effect here with plexiglass roof panel. Let's go forward and check this out in the bow. Up here we've got a very impressive amount of seating. This is room for three to four people sitting facing forward and then there's armrests that can separate them out if you want to really get comfortable. We also ordered this boat with a table for the bow area. And of course it's got the anchor windlass so that you're not having to pull the anchor up manually. We also have the gray snap-in sea deck on this boat. So you can pull it all out for easy cleaning but it has a really nice feel underfoot. You might be wondering what's in here. This is storage for the cockpit TV. The cockpit TV mounts and goes over by the grill. The cockpit TV is stored securely here when not in use. Let's check out the cabin real quick. There's no batteries installed in this boat yet, so Sorry for the lack of lighting, but you've got a folding table here that allows maybe six people to sit around the table up here in the V-berth. And then a, a nice sized TV with a Bose sound bar and 
Sea Ray has really minimized the galley in this boat because of the huge cooking area upstairs with two grills and two refrigerators. But there is a small refrigerator here and a microwave. You know, you gotta microwave that popcorn. And then your main sleeping area is gonna be aft here. We've still got some pillows and cushions wrapped up. As I said, this boat just came in and this is a uh, preview video for you. Check out the head compartment. You've got tile floor, kind of a designer bowl type sink. And there is a shower in here. I get a lot of requests for shower pictures, so might as well go ahead and get you going there. Your shower's right here. Check this out. One of the game-changing features of the SLX 400 is the hull side actually drops down to where it's flat and becomes a swim platform off the side of the boat. And in order to better utilize that feature, this seating area can slide to make it where you've got two different angles that you can use the sun pad. Really an awesome seating configuration. So as we close that back, I can show you here. Check out the storage. Here in Texas, they call that a cooler, but you could also put fenders and dock lines and all your extra stuff there. And then here's something that you don't see every day. You open this up, and there's room for two stand-up paddle boards in here. What other boat do you know that you can carry your, your paddle boards with you so that when you're anchored in a cove, you can go paddle around and then when that's closed nobody even knows they're there super awesome always get to see an SLX 400 out of the water but I thought I'd point out a few things this one's equipped with the Seacore Bravo 3x drives so this one's saltwater friendly these are much more corrosion resistant than the normal Bravo 3s and here's your machinery for your swim platform lift and you can see this one's got the through hull underwater lights and I love how Sea Ray tucks the trim tabs up underneath the boat. They're much more effective under there and they, they work a lot faster. One last time let's go check out the side of this boat because this is a one-of-a-kind color. You're not going to pass yourself coming and going with this. It's a, it's a dark, dark charcoal gray, almost black. And that's paint, not gel coat. So it's gonna be super durable and really gorgeous. This is a one of a kind boat. We're so happy to have it in stock. If you need more information on it, give me a call, Roger Duffy, 512-750-8169, or check it out at marinemax.com.